people are not aware and therefore they always say so as a yeah. founder i'm extremely particular about the quality of content that we have quality of uh, teaching that we have and quality of results that we have and i'm obsessed with producing results i can tell you that i have been obsessed uh, in producing results since my very first year this exam opens your mind like anything because this is very unstructured problems right right so life is all about unstructured problem solving there are three basic olympiads uh, which a student uh, try to prepare in the grades like 7th 8th 9th or 10th the first olympiad is junior science olympiad which is for 8th and 9th grade there are few students of 10th grade they can also appear because it is limited by age so 8th and 9th they can appear in this junior science olympiad and this junior science olympiad is a olympiad which is uh, conducted by government of india and uh, students participating in that can represent the country if uh, they get selected so there are three to four stages they have to clear that represent the country at a global scale and get gold and silver or bronze for the country so that is one exam the second exam uh, is maths olympiad typically maths olympiad is nothing to do with your actual maths which is asked in jee advance but any student between 8th and 12th they get the same paper uh, so maths olympiad is conducted again by homi baba uh, center and uh, it is basically a exam which has three to four stage again iok starts with iok basic basic stage uh, regional cutoffs are there and then it moves to rmo then inmo and then imo which is the international exam and in between you attend a camp so six students represent there and again they fight uh, with, across the country like the asian country the chinese country the us countries and uh, they compete for gold and our country is representing any center right so that is the second exam but this exam opens your mind like anything because this is very unstructured problems right, right? so life is all about unstructured problem solving and this exam is very closer to solving challenges of life, right so this is the second exam recently the third exam which is uh, earlier used to be like ntsc exam. Mm. now the government again has launched iapt which is a uh, again physics uh, body uh, indian association of physics teachers so basically this has launched a sehss exam which is an olympiad for 10th graders any student between you know screen grade to 10th grade is open to open to all but any student can give that exam but mostly the syllabus is for 9th and 10th so recommended for 9th and 10th graders who are ahead of their class and this exam is like it will actually compete you against all your friends in your 10th grade or 9th grade at a national level at a very high level so very equivalent to ntsc but it has physics it has chemistry it has io it has uh, maths and 15 question each recently launched this year so it is a new exam but i think it is going to be a uh, replacement of ntsc uh, in going ahead so students should start with a milestone and start preparing for this exam again not taking the pressure to clear this exam because these exams will only mentally yeah. uh, make you stronger right so it will actually make you stronger mentally and uh, also help you think how a student thinks in 11th and 12th for any competitive exam olympiad is the toughest examination tougher than uh, j advance tougher than uh, you know any competitive exam out there yeah. and if we are successfully producing more number of students not only percentage more number of students than any offline institute which means the uh, online system works spectacularly because that's the testimony of the toughest examination out there in this two years or three years it's a simulation of life pressures will sometimes go down will sometimes get up Uh, and i think all this simulation is preparing you for the real life because life will throw you challenges it will never stop throwing the challenges and i think the obsession that i ask my teachers is only this very simple things and if any teacher does not have that no matter the, how great that teacher is we don't have that